we are back. Now, uh, before we go on, I wanted to warn, I wanted to warn all the kids in the studio right now about a very scary monster that lives right here in the NBC building. Now, let me, let me tell you about him. Let me tell you about him. Kids, he's called the boredom monster because he loves to eat people who aren't having any fun. And you know what that means? Tell them what that means, Andy. Well, that means that if your kids sort of, if you start getting bored or you start uh, getting too quiet, then the monster will come and he'll try and get us. He'll try and eat us all. That's right. Andy's not kidding about this. And kids, if the boredom monster comes, there's only one way to get him to leave us alone. And that's to laugh and clap as loud as you can so that he knows we're not really bored. He hears that, and then he goes away, and then... Uh-oh. Oh, no, kids! The boredom monster alarm is going off! No, the boredom monster's outside. He's in the hall! Kids, that worked. He went away. Good for you. That was very good. Nice work, kids. Yeah. By the way, kids, I just want you to know the boredom monster has attacked this show many times. Oh, many, many times. So we're free now. All right. Now, kids, uh, let's get on to the next part of the show. My first guest is a founding member of the Kids in the Hall comedy troupe, and you can be seen each Wednesday night on news radio here on NBC. Please welcome Dave Foley. Oh, I thank you. Going hi, hi, Isn't kids. This nice? Everyone, go hi, Dave. Hi. Hi. It's nice, isn't it? It's a nice it change of nice. pace. It is. Yeah, it is. Well, for you, you don't have kids. No, you have them. <laughs> yeah. So this is sheer hell for you, it's, isn't it? It's just like being home. Yeah. Because I, I have actually 150 children. Mm. Yeah. All right. Now, hey, kids, settle down. We're going to talk to Dave Foley for a bit. Uh -huh. It's not going to take very long. No. Right. Now, first of all, what we're going to do... <laughs> Kids! What? Dave? Yes? I understand you did some traveling lately. I did. I went to Africa. I, uh, I flew to, to Zimbabwe, Africa, and uh, flew into Harare, and then, and then from there went on to spend Christmas at Victoria Falls. Victoria Falls? I understand yeah. that's very beautiful. Yeah, it is very beautiful. or we won't play the game. All right, now settle down. Now, this is a game we're going to play using you kids in the audience, all right? That's right. Now, Dave, I don't know yes. if you can use this. We can use our advanced computer technology to look into the future and see what these kids are going to look like when they get old. That's right. We're going to show you kids. We're going to show you kids what you're going to look like when you're old. For example, let's look at this kid right here. Look at what he looks like when he's old. Look! That's right. Now look at this girl right here. Let's see what she's going to look like. Oh! Her eyes.
boys are gonna go. Look at this little girl right here. What is she gonna look like? Oh no! Oh no! That's terrible. How about this boy right here? Let's see what he's gonna look like. No! Oh, let's see what this boy's gonna look like. I'm curious, Dave, aren't you? And oh! Hold it. Let's see what this kid's gonna look like right here. She wants it. Let's see right now. No! Hey, wait a minute. You asked for it. <laughs> see this kid right here. And oh! This kid right here, fun. Oh! All right, kids, we hope you enjoyed that. Uh, we're gonna give you all glasses of water. And uh, we'll be right back after this break. Dave Foley, thank you very much, Dave.